Google is pushing a new API to all Chromium-based web browsers. This affects, for example, Google Chrome, Microsoft Edge, Brave Browser, Opera, Vivaldi, and all other Chromium-based browsers. This new API extremely limits the functionality of browser extensions. Google claims the purpose behind these are security reasons, but in reality, the new API will basically make any ad blocker or privacy extension useless. The real reason why Google is pushing this new API is to bypass ad blockers and tracking blockers so that they can show you more ads and by showing you more ads they will make more money. As I said, all Chromium based web browsers are affected by this new API. This is why you should switch to Firefox right now. Firefox is not a Chromium based web browser and that's why ad blockers and tracking blockers will continue to work in Firefox. If you want an even better privacy choice, you should switch to LibreWolf. LibreWolf is a modified version of Firefox with increased privacy and security standards. It's probably the best out of the box privacy browser you can get. I use it on a daily basis. If you are curious about the new API from Google, check out the link in the video description which will lead you to a video from the Linux experiment who explains the new API in detail. Now if you are thinking, but I don't want to change my browser because it's too much work, well, that's simply not true, because it's really easy. All you need to do is go to Firefox website, download the browser and install it. That's all there is to it. Another reason why you should switch to Firefox or LibreWolf is if you're using Microsoft Edge or Google Chrome, you have zero privacy. They can see every single website you visited and when you visited it. So ask yourself, do you really want that? And if that is not enough reason for you to switch to Firefox, well, you should make the switch anyways because by using Chrome or Edge, you are allowing Google and Microsoft to track you and show you ads. And by doing that, you help them make money. Besides, it's a very bad idea to help Google and Microsoft making money because these corporations clearly already have more than enough money, power and influence. So you really should avoid them whenever possible. By the way, if you're using Google search, your search results will be censored Google only shows you search results they want you to see. Basically, Google is manipulating and brainwashing billions of people that are using Google search and either these people don't care or they are completely dumb. Either way, it is time to wake up and leave the Google ecosystem. Anyways, if you need multiple web browsers for different purposes, I suggest get Firefox, get Firefox Developer Edition, get LibreWolf and get LibreWolf Portable version. That's already four different browsers, so that should be enough for most people. Links will be in the video description. And of course, don't forget to install an ad blocker like uBlock Origin immediately after installing Firefox to block ads and trackers. This is like a must have for privacy. Some of you might be familiar with DuckDuckGo. The LibreWolf browser by default uses DuckDuckGo search engine. However, DuckDuckGo had a secret tracking agreement with Microsoft. So the search engine can no longer be trusted when it comes to privacy. That's why I switched to Brave Search. Firefox by default uses Google search. After everything I told you now, we of course don't want that. So make sure to use another search engine, like for example, Brave Search. Let me mention one more Google related topic before I end this video. If you are using Gmail, you should know that Google is scanning all of your emails. That means every single message, be it incoming or outgoing, is scanned by the Google algorithm. Google claims this is necessary to identify potential criminal activities. However, would you be okay if I read all of your emails? Or if anybody read all of your emails? Because that is essentially what the Google algorithm is doing. When it scans your mails, it's basically reading them. So I ask, are you okay with that? And if not, why are you using Gmail? If you don't want Google to scan all of your emails, you should switch to ProtonMail or Tutanota, which are both privacy friendly options. Links are in the video description. And don't forget, Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge know your complete browsing history. Every single website you ever visited, they know it all. So if you don't want that, Switch right now and take back your privacy.